Ozamis, officially the city of Ozamis, Cebuano, Dakbayan Sa Ozamis, Filipino, Lungsod ng Ozamis, or simply referred to as Ozamis City, is a third-class city in the province of Misamis Occidental, Philippines. According to the 2015 census, it has a population of 141,828 people, although occasionally spelled as Ozamis in official sources, City Resolution 25105 officially spelled Ozamis with a Z as its last letter rather than with an S. Geography Ozamis is close to Zamboanga del Sur and Zamboanga del Norte provinces, while across the bay is Lanao del Norte. Ozamis is 52 kilometers 32 miles from Maria Cristina Falls, the main source of hydroelectric power in Mindanao. Barangays Ozamis is politically subdivided into 51 barangays. History The city of Ozamis grew out of an old Spanish town called Misamis, a name believed to have been derived from the Subanan word, Kayamas, a variety of coconut. Other unverified historical sources, however, suggest that the name Misamis came from Misa. After the Catholic Mass, the origin and the growth of the old Spanish town, Misamis, was due to the presence of the Spanish garrison stationed at the stone fort named Nuestra Señora de la Concepción del Triunfo, which was constructed some time in the 18th century in order to control the pirate activities originating in the nearby Lanao area. In 1850, the town of Misamis became the capital of the district of Misamis. In October 1942 Wendell Fertig established the command headquarters of the growing guerrilla resistance to the Japanese occupation of Mindanao in the Spanish fort in the city. His headquarters was abandoned June 26, 1943, in the face of a large Japanese attack. Until the end of the war the Japanese occupied this fort. The Ozamis City website said of this. During the Japanese occupation of Misamis in World War II, 1943 to 1945, the Kata was garrisoned by a contingent of Japanese who dug foxholes near or under the walls. This undermining of walls later led to the destruction of the southwest bastion in the earthquake of 1955. After the Second World War, Misamis became a chartered city by virtue of Republic Act 321 on July 16, 1948. RA 321 also renamed Misamis to Ozamis after a WW2 hero Jose Ozamis who hailed from the province of Misamis Occidental and who at one time also served as its governor and congressional representative of the Lone District of Misamis Occidental, a delegate to the 1935 Constitutional Convention that resulted in the creation of the 1935 Constitution for the Philippine Commonwealth Government. In 1941, Jose Ozamis was elected to the Philippine Senate. On July 30, 2017, 2.30 a.m., PST, the mayor of Ozamis, Reynaldo Paraginog Sr., his wife, brother, and their security guards were killed during a police raid. Paraginog was among the more than 150 officials deterred publicly linked to drugs in August last year as part of a shame campaign. Demographics in the 2015 census, the population of Ozamis was 141,828 people, with a density of 830 inhabitants per square kilometer or 2,100 inhabitants per square mile. Economy Ozamis is agricultural by resources, but it has become the center for commerce, health, transportation, and education in this part of Mindanao, considering its strategic location and its peaceful atmosphere. The city has good harbor location, its local port is the principal outlet of mineral deposits, agricultural and forest products of the provinces of Misamis Occidental, Zamboanga del Norte, Zamboanga del Sur, Maguindano, parts of Lanao del Norte, and Lanao del Sur. Retail Due to the location of the city, Ozamis enjoys several and notable malls and shopping centers within its city center. People coming from Misamis Occidental, parts of Lanao del Norte and parts of Zamboanga del Sur will come also to Ozamis for their shopping needs. 
Gaisano Capital Mall Ozamiz is noted as the biggest mall in the city with the expansion of a new South Wing Mall in 2011. Novo Ozamiz also expand and construct their own bigger building with a hotel named Asia Novotel in 2010. Unitop Ozamiz also expand their building in 2012 in front of City Public Mall with a bridged sky walk for an easy access from the second floor of both buildings. City Public Mall, formerly known as City Public Market, is the biggest public establishment in northwestern Mindanao. It is owned and managed by the local government unit of Ozamiz and opened on May 28, 2009. Robinson's Supermarket opened to the public on November 30, 2012. Tourism and culture Notable events and festivals The Feast of Our Lady of Triumph of the Cross at Kata Shrine is celebrated every July 16 which is also the Charter City Anniversary. Subayan Keg Subanan Festival is also held on the same day. The Kata Entertainment Area has free live band concerts and other musical variety shows each weekend. Fireworks displays are held at Kata during fiesta and holidays. It can be seen across Pangui Bay as far as Lanao del Norte. The Feast of Our Lady of Immaculate Conception is celebrated every December 8 while every fourth Sunday of January is the senior. Sto, Nino Fluvial Parade held at Pangui Bay. Balanghoy Festival is held annually at Kata area. Attractions Fuerte de la Concepción y del Triunfo, also known as Cata Shrine, is a fort built in 1755 by Father José Ducos to serve as a Spanish outpost in the area. A special chapel was built inside the walls of the fort and an image of the Virgin of the Immaculate Conception, in the pink and blue attire, was enshrined in the chapel and outside the fort on the wall facing the bay, was a carved image of the Virgin Mary, Nuestra Señora de la Inmaculada Concepción y del Triunfo de la Cruz de Migpongi. The image on the Cata's wall is believed to be miraculously growing and has been the object of pilgrimage. The fort was renovated and restored to its original design in 2006. Cata will undergo improvement and development with construction of a boulevard with a Spanish galleon replica, Cata Park with parking area, a mini commercial complex for food stalls, ticketing offices, restos, cafes and souvenir shops. Bukagan Hill, has a view of the city, Pangui Bay, the provinces of Lanao del Norte and Zamboanga del Sur. There are four great bells at the top of Bukagan Hill. The bells were named after St. Peter. St. Mary, St. Joseph, and St. Michael, and were originally purchased by Bishop Patrick Cronin, D.D., for the Immaculate Conception Cathedral. However, the bells weigh seven tons and were found to be too heavy and too large for the cathedral's belfry. The people felt that it was very expensive to construct a special belfry for them considering that a lot of fundraising effort was made for the building of the cathedral and the installing of the pipe organ. It was through the efforts of then City Mayor Fernando T. Bernard that the bells were finally given a place at the Bukagan Hill. With the help of Jesus Y. Varela, the huge bells were installed in Bukagan Hill Bells and officially inaugurated on July 16, 1948. Naomi's Botanical Garden and Tourists Inn, sits on a 12-hectare property of local and imported tropical flowers, plants and fruit seedlings. There are fully air-conditioned private rooms, function halls, tennis court, golf range, ceramics factory, pottery and a bakery inside this sprawling garden. Mount Malindang Golf and Country Club, this is a pre-war army facility converted into a golf course located in Bagake at the foot of Mount Malindang. Immaculate Conception Pipe Organ, found in the choir loft of the Immaculate Conception Cathedral, is the only existing pipe organ in Mindanao and one among the few throughout the country. An Irish Columban priest, Father Sean Lavery, who was in charge of the liturgical and musical development in the Immaculate Conception Cathedral realized the need for an organ. Funds were raised through donations and a musical extravaganza organized by the parish raised enough money to buy the pipe organ. Father Lavery asked the help of a German priest, Father Hermann Schablitzky SVD, who came to Ozamis to get the specification needed to guide the organ builders in Germany. Father Schablitzky himself, assisted by one carpenter and one electrician, assembled the organ in six weeks and it was completed on May 31, 1967. 
It was inaugurated on July 16, 1967, the feast day of Our Lady of Mount Carmel. Immaculate Conception Cathedral. The cathedral was built from the ruins of a church destroyed in an earthquake. It was one of the early designs of national artist for architecture Leandro Loxin. His simple style of squares, circles, and half circles are evident in the external and internal designs of the church. The facade was later changed. Transportation Air Ozamiz Airport, also known as Labo Airport, was reopened last July 5, 2007, nine years after Philippine Airlines PAL stopped their operations using Fokker 50 and Sunriser planes and eventually went the airport to its closure due to its short runway in which cannot accommodate jet planes. Air Philippines, a subsidiary airline of PAL, was the first airline served the airport for Manila using B737-200 which is also the first jet plane to land the airport while PAL Express, another PAL subsidiary, was then served direct flights to Cebu again using their Bombardier Q400. PAL's competitor, Cebu Pacific later opened their service in Ozamiz with its first flight to Cebu on November 10, 2008 using their brand new ATR-72-500. With high demand of passengers, cargo and tourist arrivals, Cebu Pacific then launched its Manila route with their Airbus 319, while PAL took over Air Philippines service to Manila using also the Airbus 319 last June 16, 2009. When Air Philippines took its rebranding as Airfil Express, now PAL Express, it then relaunched its Ozamis to Manila flight last August 18, 2011 using their Airbus A320. It then forces Cebu Pacific to change its aircraft to replace all of their ATR-72-500 that serves Ozamis Airport to an Airbus A319 and Airbus A320. Despite fierce competition between PAL and Cebu Pacific, PAL ended their operations in Ozamiz last March 25, 2012, leaving their affiliate PAL Express to compete with Cebu Pacific. Since then, the competition between PAL Express and Cebu Pacific became the duopoly in serving to and from the airport. Ozamiz Airport will undergo a P300M expansion and development with installation of runway lights, extension of runway from its current of length 1.9 km to 2.1 km and construction of a new passenger terminal building. C. There are several major shipping lines serving Cebu, Manila and Iligan routes namely, 2GO Travel, formerly Superferry, Negros Navigation and Cebu Ferries, Trans-Asia Shipping Lines, Cocaliang Shipping Lines, Carlos A. Gothong Lines, and Philippine Span Asia Carrier Corp., PSACC, former Sulpicio Lines. Cocaliang Shipping Lines increased their Cebu service from thrice to five times weekly. Local shipping lines like Dama have trips from Ozamiz to Mucas, Colombugan, Lanao del Norte routes through Roll-On, Roll-Off, Roro, ferries that transport passengers, cars, trucks and goods across Pangui Bay. Land The public mode of transportation within the city is by tricycad, pedicab and motorized tricycle, while rural transit, Super 5, UV Express, and public utility jeepneys such as Lotradisco were the predominant transport for interprovincial routes, to and from the city. Education the presence of two universities in Ozamiz, La Salle University, formerly known as Immaculate Conception College ICC, and Misamis University, makes it a premier education center in northern Mindanao. Students coming from Lanao del Norte, Zamboanga del Sur, Zamboanga del Norte and Misamis Occidental come to Ozamiz to pursue their college education. Misamis University La Salle University, Ozamiz Campus Medina College Ozamiz Misamis Institute of Technology Northwestern Mindanao Institute of Technology NMIT Our Lady of Triumph Institute of Technology OLTIT Northwestern Mindanao School of Technology NMST Immaculate Conception School of Technology ICST Vocational Institute of the Philippines and Maritime Training Center Computer Technology College 
Ozamiz City Technology and Vocational School, Lighthouse Christian Academy Secondary Schools, Misamis Union High School, formerly Misamis Chinese High School. This is the only Chinese school in Misamis Occidental. Ozamiz City National High School, Labo National High School, Pullet National High School, Stimson Abordo National High School, Labine National High School, San Antonio National High School, Ozamiz City School of Arts and Trades. FMCMA School and Tutorial Services, Inc. Health Hospitals and Healthcare Facilities Mayor Hilarion A. Ramiro Sr. Medical Center, MHARSMC, a 500-bed capacity tertiary hospital owned by the Department of Health. Misamis University Medical Center, MUMC, a tertiary hospital located at Brigi. Bagake. Medina General Hospital a 200-bed capacity tertiary hospital located at Brigi. Carmen Annex. Faith Hospital SM. Lao Memorial Hospital St. Joseph General Hospital, formerly St. Mary General Hospital. St. Padre Pio Medical Clinic, located at GEM Building, Medina Avenue, Brigi. Carmen Annex. Government Local government officials, as of July 2017 Mayor, Irene E. Luanzing, Acting, Asterisk Vice Mayor, Michael L. Tagal, Acting, Asterisk Congressman, 2nd District, Henry S. Oaminal City Councilors Michael L. Tagal Irene E. Luanzing Matronilo S. Cartagenas Taran S. Macaros Sr. Roberto A. Cantago Jr. Rico D. Amon Fritz Neil R. Baug Rizalina O. Francisco Carlito C. Bodiangan asterisk acting in capacity, while Nova Princess Paraginog and Ricardo O. Paraginog cannot fulfill the role of mayor and vice mayor while in detention. Sister cities Local Tangab Oroqueta Iligan Cotabato City Dipolig General Santos Cebu City Iloilo City Pagadian Marawi City Cagayan de Oro City See also Metro Cagayan de Oro List of renamed cities and municipalities in the Philippines Labo Airport References External links Ozamiz City Government Philippine Standard Geographic Code Local Governance Performance Management System